We're here at Trafalgar Square for something completely unusual that people miss. Are you ready? Stick with us. Here we go. We're in the heart of London at Trafalgar Square where all distance to London is measured and we're at the base of the steps just underneath the National Gallery. Many people come to Trafalgar Square, but nearly everyone misses this. These are the Trafalgar Square measurement standards and were installed here in 1876, nearly 150 years ago. In a fire that raged across London, which is only second to the Great Fire of London, this fire in 1834 burnt down much of what was then Westminster. Lost within the fire with the standards of imperial units of measurement. Following this, a mathematician and astronomer, Sir George Airy, was charged with creating new standard units of measurement. He did this between 1838 and 1842. To ensure these standards would not be obliterated like the previous ones in the fire, the standards were triplicated. One appears at the Great Hall of the Guildhall, and the second is by the gate of the Royal Observatory in Greenwich, and this is the third and final one here at Trafalgar Square. It's incredible to think that millions of people come to Trafalgar Square every year and these items are missed. All the measurements are at the base of the stairs which lead up to the National Gallery and they're both to the left and also to the right and as you can see here they're also slap bang in the middle as well as brass plants. Because these are imperial measurements, they detail the inches, feet, yards, links, chains, perches and poles. Just to help you and save your googling, a chain is a unit of length and it measures 66 feet or 22 yards. If it helps further, there are 10 chains in a furlong and even more importantly, 80 chains in one mile. So here we go, history just laying there to be walked upon. So if you get up to Trafalgar Square or revisit, then do make sure you look out for these pieces of history right here at the base of the steps under the National Gallery. If you love discovering things like this about London, then you might want to click into some of the videos that I've put in the top right hand corner in our playlist called Secret London, where you'll discover so many other great things around London as well. And if you click on those, I'll see you in those videos shortly.